Well, the last time I came here, it was a derelict shed. So actually to see this wonderful building, to see it repurposed using traditional skills and traditional materials, and to see the innovation, the digital hands-on big map of Scotland where you can use iPads to navigate and understand the historic environment across Scotland, it's just truly transformational. So uh, a big change from the derelict shed I saw a few years back. It was a major capital investment from the Scottish Government, from the Historic Environment Scotland and the Heritage Lottery Fund. And coming together with this £11 million project, we've managed to ensure that we have a real centre of excellence that professionals can learn from, but also open it up to the public, because it's really important for our young people to understand the importance of the subjects they learn at school with the opportunities in the traditional skills environment and the, the careers that are potentially there. So it's important in so many different ways, but having all together in one place, also being a, a demonstrator, an exemplar of what can be done with traditional building skills and materials by showing the transformation of a derelict building. We can show what's possible in Scotland, so there's ambition and vision in this project as well as practical can-do expertise on show, but also a great visitor attraction and it's free. Well, the engine shed, I think, is a wonderful facility for Historic Environment Scotland and for Scotland in general. It's going to be a national conservation centre, a hub for showcasing traditional materials, how we can apply them to conserve traditional buildings, but also how we can use them innovatively in modern buildings and how we can adapt those skills for modern use. Nearly half a million traditional buildings, which we want to maintain, and really important to engage people in understanding their heritage, but also understanding how they can apply those skills in the future. I've been hugely impressed by two things. Firstly, the quality of the building itself, the conversion of the main building, the restoration, but also the sympathetic and complementary additions have really made it such a beautiful building. But perhaps even more importantly is what goes on inside the building is really impressive in terms of providing a way to help people understand the importance of Scottish heritage buildings and the need to restore them and develop the skills necessary to preserve them for the future. This is a, an engine shed at the National Conservation Centre, which is for the country as a whole. But I am absolutely convinced it will have a big impact internationally as people want to come and see how Scotland is world leading in science and digital when it comes to heritage environment.